So hi, I'm uh, Joanna Mukoki and uh, I am an entrepreneur. I run a business called Travel with Flair. I've been around for 25 years or we started it 25 years ago and I'm an accountant by profession and everybody always wonders what is an accountant doing in the travel business but uh, I always believe that uh, once you're a number cruncher you can be in any business. Uh, for me, especially with having to travel as much and running such a big and demanding business, you need to be able to stay healthy. I always tell my team, I do not have downtime um, and I do not want to be able to get there. And what I do to be able to ensure that I don't do that, eating healthy for me is the number one thing. I'm not one of those people that is a sweat 1000 kind of a girl where I boom, 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 no. Uh, but you know, I obviously have my th three times a week routines where I'm trying to be able to build muscle because I'm sure you understand at our age, that's what we're going to need as we grow older because uh, you're going to need your muscles uh, to be able to hold you into your uh, sunset years. I try and make sure as well uh, at least twice a month to be able to hang with a girlfriend. You need to offload. You know, you need to be able to let out some steam and just have a bit of fun and, and talk to somebody who really cares and can be able to just shoulder part of what you're going through uh, 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 with them. So I think that's one of the things that people should not uh, be able to uh, downplay. And I think uh, more importantly, I really love new amazing places. So I want my mind to be stretched. I always say, as far as I can see is how much I can think. So I need to be able to see far. Even my office, I cannot have a wall here and I open my window, I can't see far. Because that's, I think somehow, my brain gets limited to what it sees. So if I can see far, far away, to the highway and past the highway, that's exactly how far my mind can be able to stretch. So, and I think a lot of times people don't have a conversations with themselves. I always say, Somewhere in your busy schedule, at least even once a week, have a meeting with yourself, have your quiet time and you are able to regroup and just be able to find out, you know, what I did best this week, what I didn't do well, where is it that I'm lacking, am I feeling good, you know, I give myself uh, between 1 to 10, how am I feeling, and then I find out what happened that made me to be able to not hit the 10 and then you go and address it because if you leave it things pile up and then before you know it you're not a, 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 a joyous uh, a gift giving uh, of yourself type of human being which I believe each of us can be uh, and you don't have to be outgoing in personality to be able to have that. <laughs>